Namaste, this is Krithika Madhusudan welcoming you all to the award function of Kala Shrestha Acharya hosted by Veena Dhari Institute of Music and Fine Arts. Before we go ahead, I would like to invite Master Parjanya K. Rao to do the invocation. Lambo Dara Thank 
you, Master Parjanya, for the wonderful invocation. Veenadhari Institute of Music and Fine Arts was founded by Kana Kala Kasturi Nada Jyoti Vainika Kala Pravine Vidushi Srimati Anuradha Madhusudan in the year 1985. Our mission is to promote Indian music and dance across the world and create a platform to encourage students to pursue Indian art forms. Our vision is to help spread music and dance to every nook and corner of the world with a humble intention to acknowledge and appreciate the value and significance of Indian music and dance. Our current initiatives are Gana Natya Siri Online International Level Music and Dance Competitions. Veenadhari has instituted Bala Kala Prithive Award this year for the rising talent in the field of Indian music and dance. Bala Kala Prativay Award is instituted with the main intention of motivating and encouraging the budding artists in the field of music and dance. We are very happy to have awarded this first ever Bala Kala Prativay Award to Master Aniruddha Krishna, an upcoming Carnatic vocalist and a disciple of Sri R.K. Padmanabhasar from Bengaluru. Carnatic Music Exams We conduct Carnatic Music Examinations twice every year. We provide examinations for different grades. Start at any level and keep progressing. Sangeeta Vaibhava or Ratya Vaibhava Regular music and dance concerts to promote music and dance. Veenadhari Institute of Music and Fine Arts is proudly associated with International Reiki Foundation IRF Trust and involves in the donation activities to kids and other needy people. Our upcoming initiatives are Udayotsava Free online music competitions for NGOs, old age homes, differently abled and orphanages. Gana Natyotsava, Kalotsava or Swara Natyotsava are platforms for high performing participants of our competitions Gana Natya Siri, Kala Sarabha and Swara Natya Samchama. Kala Sarabha online international level music and dance competitions. Registrations will open in the third week of July 2024. Swara Natya Samdhama Online International Level Music and Dance Competitions Registrations will open in the third week of November 2024. We are happy to have instituted an yearly award, the Kalathari Award. This is an important initiative to recognize and award upcoming artists in the field of Indian music and dance. Our first Kalathari Award was presented to Kumari Nandita Kannan, a Karnatic vocalist from Chennai in the year 2022. In 2023, our second Kaladhari Award was presented to Kumari Aditi Prahalad, a Karnatic vocalist from Bengaluru. Veenadhari has instituted Kalashesht Acharya Award this year for the best teacher in the field of Indian music and dance. Kalashesht Acharya Award is instituted with the main intention of motivating and encouraging the teachers in the field of music and dance. Behind any great musician or dancer, there is always a great teacher. So, we felt it is important to recognize and honor the talented teachers. This is Veenadhari's first step in that direction. The spirit behind this initiative is our founder chairman, Vidushi Srimati Anuradha Madhusudan. We are very happy to be awarding this first ever Kalashesht Acharya Award to Guru Srimati Mala Shankar, a dedicated and disciplined teacher from Mumbai. Immediately followed by the award function, we have a lecture demonstration by Guru Srimati Mala Shankar on guidelines on how to approach and execute Manodharmam. We have a video message from Vidwan Nakod. I'll read out a brief profile of Vidwan Nakod. Vidwan Vishwanath Nakod hails from the legendary family of distinguished musicians whose greatness is boundless. His father was renowned master vocalist Pandit Arjun Sanakod, representative of Gwalior and Kirana Gharana from Dharwad. Vidwan Vishwanath Nakod learned the art of percussion under the guidance of late Sri Virana Kamkar of Hubli. Later, he had vigorous training under his elder brother Pandit Raghunath Nakod, who secured the distinction of being recognized as one of the top great artists of the country in percussion music. Vidwan Vishwanath Nakod learned vocal training under his father late Pandit Arjun Sanakod and light music training under late Pandit Vasant Kapur of Dharwad who was a music composer and versatile harmonium player. Vidwan Vishwanath Nakod accompanied several top grade artists and has been conferred prestigious awards like Nada Prabhu Kempe Award, prestigious Arya Bhatta Award, 
ಪಂಚಾಕ್ಷರ ಕೃಪಾಭೂಷಣ್ ಅವಾರ್ಡ್ ನಮ್ಮ ಕಲಾ ಸಾಧಕರು ಫ್ರಮ್ ಕರ್ನಾಟಕ ಸಂಗೀತ ನೃತ್ಯ ಅಕಾಡೆಮಿ ಪ್ರೆಸ್ಟೀಜಿಯಸ್ ಹಾನ್ಗಲ್ ಕುಮಾರ್ ಶ್ರೀ ಅವಾರ್ಡ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ವೀರೇಶ್ವರ್ ಪುಣ್ಯಾಶ್ರಮ್ ಗದಗ್ ಸಂಗೀತ ಶ್ರೀ ಅಂಡ್ ತಬ್ಲಾ ಗರುಡಿಗ ಅವಾರ್ಡ್ಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಮೆನಿ ಮೋರ್ ಟು ಹಿಸ್ ಕ್ರೆಡಿಟ್ ನಾವು ವಿ ಶುಡ್ ಪ್ರೆಸೆಂಟ್ ವಿಡಿಯೋ ಮೆಸೇಜ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ವಿದ್ವಾನ್ ವಿಶ್ವನಾಥ್ ನಾಕೋಟ್ ಸರ್ ನಮಸ್ತೆ ಐ ಆಮ್ ವಿಶ್ವನಾಥ್ ನಾಕೋಟ್ ಟಾಪ್ ಗ್ರೇಡ್ ತಬ್ಲಾ ಪ್ಲೇಯರ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಆಲ್ ಇಂಡಿಯಾ ರೇಡಿಯೋ ಬ್ಯಾಂಗ್ಲೂರ್ ಅವರ್ ನೋಟೆಡ್ ವೀಣಾ ಪ್ಲೇಯರ್ ವಿದುಷಿ ಶ್ರೀಮತಿ ಅನುರಾಧ ಮಧುಸೂದನ್ ಡಾಟರ್ ಆಫ್ ಲೇಟ್ ಶ್ರೀ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಸ್ವಾಮಿ ರಾವ್ ಫೌಂಡರ್ ಆಫ್ ಗ್ರೇಟ್ ಆರ್ಗನೈಜೇಷನ್ ಶ್ರೀರಾಮ ಸೇವಾ ಮಂಡಳಿ ಇನ್ ಚಾಮರಾಜಪೇಟ್ ಬ್ಯಾಂಗ್ಲೂರ್ ಅನುರಾಧಾಜಿ ಎ ಫೌಂಡರ್ ಆಫ್ ವೀಣಾಧಾರಿ ಇನ್ಸ್ಟಿಟ್ಯೂಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಮ್ಯೂಸಿಕ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಫೈನ್ ಆರ್ಟ್ಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಆರ್ಗನೈಜೇಷನ್ ಡಿವೋಟೆಡ್ ಟು ದ ಕಾಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಸ್ಪ್ರೆಡಿಂಗ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಪಾಪ್ಯುಲರೈಸಿಂಗ್ ಅವರ್ ರಿಚ್ ಟ್ರೆಡಿಷನ್ ಇಂಡಿಯನ್ ಕ್ಲಾಸಿಕಲ್ ಮ್ಯೂಸಿಕ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಫೈನ್ ಆರ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಮೋಟಿವೇಟಿಂಗ್ ದಿ ಯಂಗ್ಸ್ಟರ್ಸ್ ಟು ಲರ್ನ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಪ್ರಾಕ್ಟೀಸ್ ಅವರ್ ಇಂಡಿಯನ್ ಮ್ಯೂಸಿಕ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಫೈನ್ ಆರ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಫೀಲ್ಡ್ ವೀಣಾಧಾರಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಇನ್ಸ್ಟಿಟ್ಯೂಟೆಡ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಅವಾರ್ಡ್ ಶ್ರೇಷ್ಠ ಕಲಾ ಆಚಾರ್ಯ ಟು ಎನ್ಕರೇಜ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಮೋಟಿವೇಟ್ ದಿ ಟೀಚರ್ಸ್ ಹೂ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಸರ್ವ್ಡ್ ಮ್ಯೂಸಿಕ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಡಾನ್ಸ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ರಿಯಲಿ ಎ ವೆರಿ ನೋಬಲ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಅಪ್ರಿಷಿಯೇಬಲ್ ಮೂವ್ ಬೈ ವೀಣಾಧಾರಿ ಟು ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಇನ್ಸ್ಟಿಟ್ಯೂಟೆಡ್ ದ ಅವಾರ್ಡ್ ಟು ಎನ್ಕರೇಜ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಮೋಟಿವೇಟ್ the music kind dance gurus this year the recipient is vidushi shrimati mala shankar dedicated and disciplined carnatic music artist from mumbai i am also appreciate the great work initiated by veena dhari to recognize and honor the talented teachers wishing the entire vinadhari team all the very best for all your future activities thank you and namaste thank you vidwan vishwanath nakot sir i'll next move on to the award citation the award carries a citation a shield representing the kala shreshta acharya award and a cash award of rupees 10000 now i shall read out the citation being presented to ಗುರು ಶ್ರೀಮತಿ ಮಾಲಾ ಶಂಕರ್ ವೀಣಾದರಿ ಇನ್ಸ್ಟಿಟ್ಯೂಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಮ್ಯೂಸಿಕ್ ಇನ್ ಫೈನ್ ಆರ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಎನ್ ಆರ್ ಕಾಲೋನಿ ಬ್ಯಾಂಗ್ಳೂರ್ ಫೈವ್ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಡಬಲ್ ಜೀರೋ ಒನ್ ನೈನ್ ವೀಣಾದರಿ ಇನ್ಸ್ಟಿಟ್ಯೂಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಮ್ಯೂಸಿಕ್ ಇನ್ ಫೈನ್ ಆರ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಹ್ಯಾಪಿ ಟು ಪ್ರೆಸೆಂಟ್ ದ ಬೆಸ್ಟ್ ಟೀಚರ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಇಯರ್ ಅವಾರ್ಡ್ ಕಲಾ ಶ್ರೇಷ್ಠ ಆಚಾರ್ಯ ಅವಾರ್ಡ್ ಟು ಗುರು ಶ್ರೀಮತಿ ಮಾಲಾ ಶಂಕರ್ ಯು ಹ್ಯಾಡ್ ಯುವರ್ ಇನಿಷಿಯಲ್ ಟ್ರೈನಿಂಗ್ ಇನ್ ಮ್ಯೂಸಿಕ್ ಅಂಡರ್ ಶ್ರೀಮತಿ ಪದ್ಮ ಗಣಪತಿ ಇನ್ ಚೆನ್ನೈ ಯು ಪರ್ಸ್ಯೂ ಯುವರ್ ಅಡ್ವಾನ್ಸ್ ಲೆವೆಲ್ ಟ್ರೈನಿಂಗ್ ಅಂಡರ್ ಗ್ರೇಟ್ ಮೈಸ್ಟ್ರೋ ಸಂಗೀತ ಕಲಾನಿಧಿ ಶ್ರೀ ಡಿ ಕೆ ಜಯರಾಮನ್ ಫಾರ್ ಟೆನ್ ಇಯರ್ಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಹ್ಯಾಡ್ ಟ್ಯೂಟರೇಜ್ ಆಫ್ ಸಂಗೀತ ಕಲಾನಿಧಿ ಶ್ರೀ ಆರ್ ಕೆ ಶ್ರೀಕಂಠನ್ ಬ್ಯಾಂಗ್ಳೂರ್ ಯು ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಹ್ಯಾಡ್ ಸ್ಪೆಷಲ್ ಟ್ರೈನಿಂಗ್ ಫಾರ್ ಫೈವ್ ಇಯರ್ಸ್ ಅಂಡರ್ ನೀದಮಂಗಳಂ ಶ್ರೀ ಮುದುಕೃಷ್ಣ ಅಯ್ಯರ್ ಫಾರ್ ಒತ್ತುಕುಡು ಶ್ರೀ ವೆಂಕಟ ಸುಬ್ಬಯ್ಯರ್ ಕೃತೀಸ್ ಹ್ಯಾವಿಂಗ್ ಮೋರ್ ದನ್ ತರ್ಟಿ ಫೈವ್ ಇಯರ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪೀರಿಯನ್ಸ್ ಆಸ್ ಅ ಪರ್ಫಾರ್ಮಿಂಗ್ ಆರ್ಟಿಸ್ಟ್ ಯು ಹವ್ ಗಿವನ್ ನ್ಯೂಮರಸ್ ಕಾನ್ಸರ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಅಟ್ ವೇರಿಯಸ್ ಪ್ರೆಸ್ಟೀಜಿಯಸ್ ಆರ್ಗನೈಸೇಷನ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ಕ್ಲೂಡಿಂಗ್ ತ್ಯಾಗರಾಜ ಮ್ಯೂಸಿಕ್ ಫೆಸ್ಟಿವಲ್ ಅಟ್ ತಿರುವಾಯೂರ್ other credentials include you have been a consecutive prize winner in various music competitions conducted by music sabhas in chennai including the all india level music competitions conducted by the post and telegraph department government of india you were honored by vidyodaya school chennai as nightingale of vidyodaya in 1985 you were also honored by anna adarsha college chennai as nightingale of anna adarsha college in 1990 you received the tambura prize for annama charya kritis from the hands of noted critic and musician vidwan shri sr janki ram in the competitions conducted by the indian finance society chennai in 
Many of your disciples have been winning prizes every year in prestigious competitions in various categories of music. One of your senior disciples has also performed in the Margali Utsavam Chennai Music Fest in December 2022. With 25 long years of experience as a music guru, you've been training many students in India as well as abroad, giving them various opportunities to perform on great platforms with the sole motive of passing the rich tradition and legacy to the next generations. We at Vedantri Institute of Music and Fine Arts are privileged and honored to present the best teacher award of the year. Kala Shreshta Acharya Award to you, Guru Srimati Mala Shankar. Now, the Citation Award and the Cash Award are being handed over to Guru Srimati Mala Shankar. Namaskarams, Shri Guru Bhyo Namaha. My pranams to the Almighty, my parents and to all my Gurus. I am deeply humbled and honored to have been selected to receive this wonderful award of Kala Sreshta Acharya, the best Guru of the year from the Vinadari Institute of Music and Fine Arts, Bangalore. Every music guru puts in their hard work and efforts in imparting knowledge to their students, teaching them the nuances and the intricacies and molding and shaping them from the beginner level to the concert performer level. I acknowledge and appreciate Vinadari Institute's initiative in recognizing all these hard work and efforts of a guru and I am very happy to be the first recipient of this wonderful award. My best wishes to the entire team of Vinadari for great, flourishing and flowing success in all their future endeavors. The team comprising of Vidushi Srimati Anuradha Madhusudan, Dr. Madhusudan, Kritika Madhusudan, Shruti and others have been doing a commendable job in organizing these music competitions every year. They are doing it in such a meticulous way that every student participating in these competitions feel very important, respected and honored. My students have also been taking part in these competitions and many of them have been winning consecutively prizes in all categories. They in fact keep waiting for the next season to happen because they all know that they are being judged by great musicians and stalwarts in the field of music. The entire team of Vinadari is well connected and they work in such a great inspiration and coordination that they say, we are just a call away ma'am. Any query you have, please do call us. We are very happy to answer you politely and patiently. Yes, this is what is the confidence which they give us 
and they make us feel at home and very comfortable. My best wishes to the entire team and kudos to their hard work and efforts and I wish them great success in all their future endeavors. Thank you. Namaskara. Thank you Guru Srimati Mala Shankar. Our heartiest congratulations to you. And here is wishing you from Team Vinadari a wonderful music journey ahead. Now we shall be presenting videos of students of Guru Srimati Mala Shankar. Namaskar. I am Srinidhi and I am Madhuvanti. I have been learning Carnatic music vocals from Guru Srimati Mala Shankar for around 5 years. And I have been learning the same for around 8 years. Mala Ma'am teaches us like no other teacher could. Since she not only teaches us the piece, but she also explains the delicate nuances of each ragam, its intricacies, derivation, theory, etc. From ma'am, we have not only learnt the Geetam, Varnam or Geetanam, but also dedication and respect for the art. Ma'am teaches us patiently, keenly listening and paying attention to each little Gamakama Swaram we say, and correcting us for the tiniest mistakes in order to ensure perfection. She is also a very passionate teacher, caring deeply about her students and the beautiful art of Carnatic music. She works incredibly hard to aid us on our journeys to excellence. Mala Ma'am's vast knowledge and experience in the art also enables us to take away so much from each class. It is safe to say that she is one of the most hard-working, perseverant and loving people we know and will ever know. Thank, Thank you. you. Namaskaram, my name is Janadi Aran. I have been learning Carnatic music from Guru Srimati Mala Shankar for the past 13 years. Namaskaram, my name is Taruni Aran. I've been learning Carnatic music from Guru Srimati Mala Shankar for 5 years. Thank you Veena Dali for felicitating our Guru with this award. Our Guru is a skilled musician who teaches us a variety of very beautiful Sangatis and all the Kirtanas. She also goes into the details which makes it very easy for us to understand. Yes, it allows us to gain an in-depth understanding of the Swarams behind the Sangatis we learn as well as polish our singing. Most importantly, our Guru is someone we can feel comfortable with, providing us with a pleasant environment to smoothly learn music. Yes, she's the best teacher in the Thank, Thank you. you. Namaskarams to my Guru and to everyone else. My name is Ashwaka Ayer. I've been a disciple of Guru Srimati Mala Shankar for the past 10 years. Uh, my musical journey has been shaped completely and throughout by Mala Miss. Her dedication and grit has been inspiring. Uh, from the very beginning, Mala Miss has been extremely committed to all of her students and her tireless efforts to make space for my academic schedule have helped me keep my uh, music and studies balanced. Um, she's dedicated her whole life to imparting her knowledge on Carnatic music to the younger generation. Um, over the years, what I've admired the most about Mala Miss is the way she adapts her teaching techniques according to each student and uh, brings out the best in them. Uh, she completely nurtures their potential and brings it out completely. One of the most fun aspects about my journey were, are the um, chit chat sessions I have after class. So I have been a part of her group classes as well as solo sessions with her uh, which makes the chit chat part even more fun. But having gone from group to solo classes I have been a part of collaborative singing as well as um, been able to enhance my individual singing skills uh, which was extremely helpful for me and I have been able to delve deeper into my uh, music nuances. I would just like to say that Mala Miss's influence on me goes beyond music because she's taught me passion and determination which helps in my everyday life. So thank you Miss and thank you everyone else. Namaskarams, my name is Anike Dayar. I have been learning Carnatic classical music for the past 15 years under the tutelage of Guru Srimati Mala Shankar. I am extremely pleased and happy to know that my Guru has been awarded the title of Kalash Reshtha Acharya by Vinadhari Institute of Fine Arts and Music. It has been an absolute pleasure to have had the opportunity 
to learn from my guru for the past 15 years and at the same time also be part of such a rich tradition and to be a part of the DKJ school of music there are a multitude of reasons for which my guru deserves this honor her dedication and passion to teach students is second to none she is such a kind humble and such a down to earth person she has always always been a constant support for me in throughout my career be it music or academics or in any any other phase of life i have always consulted her for her opinion and she has always given me the perfect advice and i am so grateful for her constant support and her blessings each and every class has been such a unique experience in the past 15 years we deal with so many technical aspects of carnatic music in every class be the the, the smallest and most intricate nuances of any particular raga or be a very intricate sangadi or a very sophisticated sangadi in any kriti and i think her motive has always been to to achieve that level of perfection and that sophisticated manner of presenting any kriti or a raga or even kalpana swarams or narval for that matter so i think she stands out in the way she teaches her students where she emphasizes on the importance of each and every sangadi in in a particular kriti and uh, although she 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 might be a little strict at sometimes but i'm so sure that it has helped it has helped us so much in 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 the long run where now when i look back at, at maybe 5 years back when 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 she corrected me for a very small sangadi i don't realize the importance of that back then but now when i when i when we again uh, go back to that uh, go back to practicing that song i think i really recognize that how important it is to 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 pick out the the smallest of mistakes and to correct so that we can achieve that level of perfection and that level of sophisticated rendition that we so often talk about in carnatic music and again i am i am i can keep on speaking and speaking about my guru it's, it's such a pleasure to have to have had the opportunity again to be learning from her and i'm looking forward to 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 more and more more years of rigorous training and learning more compositions and these small interactions about the nuances of carnatic music from her and uh it's it's i'm so delighted and extremely on top of the world that my guru has been bestowed upon with this with this honor and this title and i am so so happy namaskarams thank you now we go ahead with guru shrimati mala shankar's lecture demonstration about carnatic music dedicated to her receiving the kala shreshta acharya award namaskarams shri guru bio namaha I would like to share some guidelines as to how to go about singing mano dharmam in our carnatic music. Now what exactly is mano dharmam? Mano dharmam is that aspect of our music wherein the vocalist elaborates on the raga alapana giving detailed structure of the ragam and with their creativity attracting the souls and minds of the audience and then following with the singing of the kriti and then doing the naraval and kalpana swarams and concluding the kriti so this is very important in a concert style where vocalists take up one or two ragas and elaborate on them now as students you all must have learnt your initial lessons right from your swaravali varsegal chanta varsegal dattu varsegal aparsthayi varsegal alankarams geetams swarajatis varnams krutis and now to the manodharmam level now 
when we say manodharmam level there is a slight fear in the minds of all students as to how should i start going about singing the raga from where should i start how will i get the imagination how am i going to progress with the ragam what phrases should i sing what is the order in which i should proceed singing the ragam and these questions i am sure all of you must have had in your minds many times well singing manodharmam is actually i wouldn't say easy but it is very easy when you follow the steps and the right groundwork before attempting attempting to sing the manodharma so what is this groundwork what should i do can you please say ma'am what should we do you might be thinking whatever i am singing is not so attractive i am able to think only about few phrases few combinations but when my teacher renders the same ragam she is sounding amazing every phrase of hers is very beautiful and melodious now why does this happen the first point is only if you have lots of phrases before you will you be able to choose the right ones and just keep progressing with the ragam right so to have the vision of the phrases and the combination of the swarams you should be extremely thorough with the arohanam and avarohanam of a particular ragam which you have chosen to sing the alapana say for example let us take mohanam mohanam is a very melodious pleasant as well as a majestic ragam it is such a soothing ragam that every student will easily understand the structure of the ragam the arohanam and avarohanam you all must have surely learnt varavina mohana geetam right and say about a few krutis in mohanam like kadambari priyaye muthu swami dikshidas kruti swagatam krishna utkaadu venkata kavi's composition kapali papanasam shivan's composition again mail vahana valli manamohana again papanasam shivan's composition etc right so now mohanam's arohanam and avarohanam is very simple to understand right there are five swarams in the arohanam and five swarams in the avarohanam mo sa re ga pa da sa sa da pa ga so this is the arohanam and avarohanam of mohana ragam right now if you say which note is very important for mohanam just think the majestic start for mohanam always happens with ga gandharam gandharam and daivatam are the two important swaras of mohana ragam and you start with gandharam that gives the majestic start right ga na na 
So, Gandharam is very, very powerful and a very melodious, uh, important swaram of Mohanam. Now, before starting the Alapanai, I would advise all the students to just keep writing the Arohanam, Avarohanam and the combinations, different combinations and the phrases in your notebook so that you are comfortable handling those phrases with the correct swarasthanams. Right? For this, you have to first write the Arohanam, like take two parallel lines in the notebook, you just draw two parallel lines, right? On the left hand side, from bottom to top, write the Arohanam. On the right hand side of the parallel line, from top to bottom, write the Avarohanam. Right? Then, Sa, Sa, Gari, Sa, Sari, Gari, Sa, Sari, Gari, Sa, Sari, Gapa, Gari, Sa, Sari, Gapa, Dapa, Gari, Sa, Sari, Gapa, Da, Sa, Dapa, Gari, Sa, Sari, Gapa, Da, Sa, Dapa, Gari, Sa, Sari, Riga, Gapa, Pada, Da, Sa, Sa, Da, Dapa, Pa, Gari, Ri, Sa, Sariga, Sariga, Pasa, Riga, Pada, Sariga, Pada, Sada, Pasada, Paga, Sada, Pagari, Sada, Pagari, Sa, Sari, Riga, Gaga, Papa, Pada, Da, Da, Sa, Sada, Da, Da, Papa, Paga, Gagari, Ri, Ri, Sa, Sa. So, when you see the Arovanam and Avarovanam, it is easy for you to compute the different combinations and phrases of Moganam. Right? You first try to understand the Arohanam and Avarohanam phrases. Try singing them in the Swaram form and in the Akaram form as well. So like this, you just try practicing the swarams and the speeds also. First speed, second speed and third speed, right? And now you have to understand that we get more ideas from the initial lessons, the basic lessons from the Janta Varsaigal, Dhatu Varsaigal, from the Alankarams and from the Upper Stai Varsaigals. Right now, mm. now when you sing in the Maya Malvagulai, so sorry, Riga, Sariga, sorry, Riga, Gama, Mari, Riga, Gama, Riga, Mari, Riga, Gama, Mapa, Pada, Gama, Mapa, Gama, Pada, Gama, Mapa, Pada, Mama, Mapa, Pada, Mapa, Pada, Mama, Mapa, Pada, then. So you just keep going like that, right? In your Janta Varsegal Swarams, right? The similar pattern you have to. Adopt for the Mohana Raga. Sa sa re re ga sa re ga sa sa re re ga ga pa pa re re ga ga pa re ga pa re re ga ga pa pa da da ga ga pa pa da ga pa da ga ga pa pa da da sa 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 da da pa sa da pa sa sa da da pa pa ga ga da da pa pa ga da pa ga da da pa pa ga ga re re pa pa ga ga re pa ga re pa pa ga ga re re sa sa right. Then you try the combinations, different patterns, right? Sariga Risa, Sariga Pada Risa, Sariga Pada Pada Risa, Sariga Pada Zulu Pada Risa, Sariga Pada Sariza Do Pada Risa, Sariga Pada Sariga Risa Do Pada Risa, Sariga Pada Sariga Risa Do Pada Risa, Sariga Pada Sariga 
So the upper thigh vertebral, right? Or you just keep moving, proceeding beyond the octave swarams. So try to practice those swarams, not in Maya Mandava Gaulai, but in Mohanam. Of course, the Maya Mandava Gaulai ragam you are supposed to practice and handle every day. Every day is warming up, and practice is hundred percent to be done, students. And that you can take up Maya Mandava Gaulai one day, the next day another Mela Karta ragam. Say for example. Uh, uh, Karahara Priya, then you have Shankara Bharanam, right? Hari Kamboji. So, you every day you just keep trying these initial lessons in different Melakarta ragams, Pantuvarani, for example, right? So, you are getting used to the patterns and the swarasthanams of handling those ragams, right? So, then when you come to Mohanam, you have to understand that these combinations you can get the ideas from these uh, initial lessons right then you go to the alankaram pattern mm. sar sari sari ga ma re ga re ga ma pa ga ma ga ma pa da ma pa ma pa da ni pa da pa da ni sa sa ni sa ni da pa ni da ni da pa ma da pa da pa ma ga pa ma pa ma ga re ma ga ma ga re sa right so this is your chaturasra jati rupakatana right Similarly, in Mohanam you can try this. Sari sari ga pa re ga re ga pa da ga pa ga pa da sa pa da pa da sari da sa da sari ga ga re ga re sa da re sa re sa da pa sa da sa da pa ga da pa da pa ga re pa ga pa ga re sa. Right. So you have to take the tips from the initial lessons and try to incorporate the same in Mohana ragam and try to increase the your. Uh, approach to the swarams and the swarasthanams and the patterns. Yes. Now, when you start a ragam, you start with the gandharam, right? Tadana, tadarana, na 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 na. This can be a start, right? So you may be asking a question: Why only this? Is this allowed? Can't I start with some other uh, phrase? Yes, you can. But it should be very authoritative that you. It should inform the listeners that you are singing Mohanam only. Okay, so that you have to make sure whenever you are starting the ragam, any ragam for that matter. Okay, so if you want to say, ta da ta da ra na na ra na, so kar kar priya. The immediate first phrase anyone should be able to say that oh she is going to sing kar kar priya. Ta da ra na na ra 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 ta da ra. हम सतवनि तर नन नर नाना तर नन 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 नार अनु तर वसंता राइट सो इट्स वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट दैट एवरी रागम यू स्टार्ट यू मस्ट बी एबल टू convey to the listeners that yes i am 100% singing this ragam only you have got it right yes so this is very very important right so ga pa ga ri sa ri da da sa ri ga ga ta ra na na na
So when you start the ragam, you start with Gandharam, right? Then you go about singing some phrases at the lower part, lower sancharas, right? Now proceed to the next note, which is pa panchamam. See, you have to remember that sa ri ka pa da. These are the five stations of Mohanam, right? So in every station, you need to show your creativity, right? Now, Gandharam is very prominent. So we started with Gandharam, okay? And along with Riga, so Ri is just a supportive note. So you can't, you can do some Sancharas in, with the Ri as a final note, but more than that, your Gandharam is very powerful, right? So, Sariga, Sariga Paga, Riga Da Paga, right? So then after doing some Sancharas in Gandharam, go to Pa, Pa, So, Panchamam, then go to Daivatam. You have to do some Sancharas in Panchamam. Remember, every step in every station, you have to include the Garvai, which is the sustaining Swara, right? Along with sustaining Swaram, you have the combinations of the different phrases in the Gamakam oriented way, and then the Briga, the fast phrases, Briga oriented way. And then you have the patterns. You have to follow some patterns, just changing, quickly changing the patterns to make it more attractive and creative. Right? So like this, some patterns, and some phrases in Panchamam, then you proceed to the Sarega Pada Ranana Tada Ranana Nana Ranana Ranana so after Daivatam, you have to go to the Shadjamam. Then in Shadjamam again, you have to do the sustaining notes. Okay, small phrases combinations then branching out to the nearest notes down and above the shadjama okay and then do some attractive phrases Now, after Shajamam, Tadaranana, 
swarams you have to come back down again to the normal note where you started the basic uh, come back to the shajamam now as the at, at the last point you have to just make a complete brushing through all the swarams like how you do the eight like for the motor driving school test you all must have uh, done the eight right similarly the final round up of the entire ragam right from the shajamam to the octave note touching it all the other swarams and then coming back <laughs> You stop with the Shajamam, right? At the lower point of the Avarogalam. Now, you might be asking me the questions. Oh, ma'am, you have the experience. You have been observing and listening to Mohanam. So, you are able to do. So, what about us? When, when can we do like this? Yeah, it is actually simple. First, you have to start getting, gaining your confidence. The confidence level is very, very important in anything. Right? And for attempting to sing a Manodharmam also, the confidence is very important. Please believe that you can do it. Yes? Yes, I can do it. That there are materials before me. I have lots of inputs for me to proceed with the ragam. So, as I told you, write down the phrases of Mohanam, right? And then keep practicing the Jante Varasai, Dhat Varasai combinations and then listen to the uh, Mohanam ragam renditions of uh, great masters it is available in just one just one press of the button you get it in the YouTube right everybody is having everything ready in the mobile now because of technology thanks to technology right so you can just keep listening to Mohana Ragam rendered by different stalwarts of music right great masters then you get an idea as to how to go about singing the Ragam not only to the musicians but also listen to the accompanying artists, the violinists. They also give a wonderful uh, Raga Alapana sketch, right? So that will boost your confidence and you will get inspiration from those phrases. And somewhere in your mind, it will be, it will be there. It will always be uh, edged in your mind. And then when you try, try singing the Alapana, somewhere it will hit you and you will be able to get the same phrase. So, whatever you store will automatically be used, right? So, students, don't lose hope. It, it is always possible. Nothing is impossible in this world. Now, coming to the Kalpana Swaram singing. Now, you have, uh, say for example, we'll take up... And one thing you noticed, see... Kadam bari priya yai kadam baka na namaste 
Namaste. So this Kriti of Muthu Swami Dikshitar starts in Ga. Kadam Ga Pada Da Pa. Similarly, your Swagatam Krishna Sharanagatam Krishna. Iha Swagatam Krishna Sharanagatam Krishna Mama Swagatam Krishna Sharanagatam Krishna Mama Swa Sa starts with Sa, right? Similarly, Nanu Palim. This starts with again ga gandharam. Now then you have ka pali ka pali ka pali. So this again, God starts again with God. Right, then my Yuvahana Vali Manamohana My Yuvahana Vali Manamohana Dasadapa My Yuvahana So that starts with Da. So now you can understand Mohanam, the entire Arovanam, Avrovanam is so precious and so important. You have Kritis starting in every note, every Swaram of Moganam. Not only Ga, okay, we saw the Kriti starting from Da, Daivatam, we, we saw the Kriti starting from Sa, Shajamam. So, it's very important for you to understand that Kalpana Swaram singing is actually very simple because you have lot of, lot of tips to take from the Arovanam and Avarovanam itself. Your Sari ga pa da Sari ga Ga re sa da pa ga re sa So Sari ga pa da Sari ga You can sing 8 swarams So how, how should I start the next swaram? This thinking you need not have because your, you know the Arohanam phrase Ar Arohanam and Avarohanam right? So sa, first swaram you can start with sa Second swaram you can start with three Third swaram Ga, fourth swaram Pa, right? Fifth swaram Da, then Sa, like that. So the starting trouble you will not have, right? Once you start singing the swarams, you have to just keep going till the eight swarams, and then you can you can choose any uh, from Rishabham or Gandharam or any any swaram for a bigger round of Kalpana swarams, right? For example. Mm, my Yilvahana Vali Manamohana My Yilvahana Vali Sadiga Pada My Yilvahana Riga Pada Pada My Yilvahana Gariga Pada Pada My Yilvahana Pagari ka pada mail bahana Dada pagari ka pada mail bahana Sa sa da da paga pada mail bahana Lisa da pagari ka pada mail bahana Gari sa da paga pada mail bahana so now I sang eight small swarms, right? Sariga pada sariga. Okay. So you can just imagine 
these swarams are all small ones so singing the smaller swarams is actually the challenge the bigger swarams it's easy for us to go about because we can have take some uh, time or in between some gap or something to think right i am talking from the point of view of a uh, beginner level to manodharma right so when as students you can have some uh, few spaces uh, just left blank or you can just uh, just keep blank space and then continue with the swarams when you are going around four to five avartanams but the smaller ones are the more challenging ones because you should complete the swaram at the proper time and the spacing is very important and imagine you are going to start with these small swarams and proceed uh, to go for the bigger and bigger swarams that is how you proceed in the kalpana swarams right so the more you practice the shorter ones it's very easy for you to understand that you can just do uh, the two three avartanams and then incorporate these smaller ones of to finish the talam and take the uh, go to the correct place you understand so now we have sadi ka pata sati gare sada pagare ka pata mayel vatana sadi ka pata mayel vatana ri ka pata da pagari ka pata mayel vatana ga pata so do pagari sari ga pata mayel vatana pada do paga pada do do paga ri ga pada mayel vahana da da paga ri ga pa paga ri ga pada mayel vahana sa ri ga sa ri sa da paga ri sa ri ga pada mayel vahana ri ga sa ri da sa pada ga pa sa ri ga pada mayel vahana ga ga ri ri sa ri ri sa sa da sa sa da do paga pada mayel vahana so same way eight swarams i sang sari ga sari ga pa da sari then ga ga ri sa da pa ga ri sari ga pa da ma gel va ha na so eight swarams you can simply sing with the shorter duration right now when you are have to go to the longer swarams ma gel va ha na ga ri ga 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 gagari ri ga gagari gari ri ga gaga gagari sada sati ga pagga ga pagga ga gari gari ri ri sari sa sa sada sati ga pagga ri sari ga pada mai gel va ga na ga pada da 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 sa da pada ta pagari ga pada pagari sari ga pada sa da pagari gari paga da pa sa da ri sa da pagari sari ga pada sa ri gari sa da pagari ga pada ma yel va sa na ga ga pa 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 ga ga pa 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 ga pada su du pagari ga pa pa gari sari ga pada ta pagari ga pa pa gari sari ga ga ri sa gari paga da pa sa da ri sa gari ga sa ri da sa pa da ga pa ri ga da pa ga ri sa ri ga pa gari sa da pa ri sa ga pa ga sa da ga pa da ma kil va ga na how do you come to the uh, core way so when you start singing the big swarams you need uh, you need five 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 say the core way is gari sa da pa ri sa da pa ga sa ri ga pa da so 555 15 right and you must note one thing that in the slow speed every beat will have two two swarams count two two counts in the fast speed every beat will have four four counts right so 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 you have 16 counts for this side totally you need only 15 right gari sada pa ri sada pa ga sa ri ga pa da or gari sada pa ri sada pa ga sa da ga pa da anything right so 15 unit so gari sada pa ri sada pa ga sa ri ga pa da will give you that 555 combination understood so you have you just keep going about two three avartanams and connect it in such a way that 
पगरी सदा परी सदा पग सनी का पद मंगल वाहना नाउ व्हेन यू टॉक अबाउट सिक्स 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 कॉम्बिनेशन ऑफ कंप्लीशन फॉर द कोरवाई फॉर द स्वरम इट इस एटीन राइट नाउ यू ऑलरेडी हैव सिक्सटीन हियर यू नीड टू मोर सो द टू मोर यू हैव टू टेक फ्रॉम हियर एंड एवरी बीट हैज फोर काउंट्स सो आफ्टर टू काउंट्स यू स्टार्ट द कोरवाई सारी गरी सदा परी सदा पग सदा गपद मैल वाहना दत्त सरी री सदा सरी गरी री सदा री सरी सदा पद सरी री सदा पग री सरी गपद सरी गरी सदा पग री सरी री री का गा गपा पा पद गरी सदा परी सदा पग सदा गपद मैल वाहना similarly you have seven 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 twenty one in that 21 seven so seven 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 you need in this complete side you have the 16 right you have four 20 plus one from here so one you have to take from here means after three swarams you need to sing the four way सारी सगाटी सदा परी सदा पग सगाटी गपद मैल वाहना सारी सगाटी सदा परी सदा पग सगाटी गपद मैल वाहना वल्ली सो यू अंडरस्टैंड चिल्ड्रन स्टूडेंट्स सी दिस इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट दैट यू नीड टू अंडरस्टैंड द कैलकुलेशंस सो गो फ्रॉम बिहाइंड राइट गो फ्रॉम बिहाइंड सो फ्रॉम हियर यू स्टार्ट सो फोर Four, 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 sixteen, and then you you come back here, four, and then one from here. So to take exactly at the initial level, it is slightly difficult. So you just complete it with three. After three swarams, you get the four by. So you have to uh, think in your mind and remember certain uh, tips so that it is easy for you to execute when you are spontaneously singing. the kalpana swarams understood um i think uh, whatever i have uh, just read today uh, will be very useful for all the students who are at the beginning level of attempting to sing the manodharmam or you have been trying for some time uh, to sing the manodharmam ragam uh, nerval and kalpana swarams um kalpana swarams are very very interesting once you start getting into it it's like a game actually it's like a brain game you can just keep uh, uh, testing yourself your capability yes i must do this today i must without any break i must do four five avartanams of kalpana swarams for this kriti right so you just keep put a test to yourself and try listening uh, more of listening to the concerts and more than that very very important advice to all the students is please go individually to attend the concerts live okay when you are attending the concerts live in a kacheri sabha or any temple or organization or an auditorium you learn a lot and lot really i'm 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 from my experience of these 25 years of teaching and with my, with uh, handling my students for so many years i have been giving this uh, advice to all my students that it's very very important that you should go to the venue to listen to the concerts rather than sitting at home and uh, just listening to the youtube of course youtube is very 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 useful of you have everything here in your hands at home and um, uh, and uh, digital uh mode is really a welcome one but make sure that you attend live concerts because you will know how the artist is sitting on the stage how th there is something called stage presence how the uh, how the vocalist is presenting their uh, uh, uh concerts how they are encouraging the violinists and the mridangis uh, along with the entire team work happens there so there is an i to i contact with the with the accompanying artists as well as with the audience right that's these are all the very important point to note when you go to a listening to a live concert right how the uh, vocalist is putting the talam clearly showing every beat 
that is very important and how they are using the mic that's very very important how to handle the mic when you are going on the higher notes when you are going to the lower notes and when you are doing your alapana how to adjust the mic distance okay and the next one where to give chance or the opportunity to the violinist how how the violinist and the vocalist they pair up uh with each other and how they bring about a wonderful uh, jugalbandi like uh, attractive uh, with with attractive phrases with attractive uh, innovations right all these you must you must uh, uh, observe and then how the tani avartanam is being played by the mridangist tani avartanam is very very important you when you have you just keep putting the talam when the artist is playing so that you are also one with the uh, with the laya aspect and you are able to understand the whatever uh, uh, innovations the mridangist is uh, giving from their side right so the entire concert uh, experience is very very important then it's it's very important for you to observe how the krutis are being rendered and without much gap they start with the next kruti immediately and how uh, after the naraval after the naraval is over the violinist takes up their uh, uh, turn of uh, rendering it and then after every kalpana swaram they give the opportunity to each other and then the final uh, korvai they both together they have a fun round okay all these are very very interesting to uh, observe and note it down and then then practice uh, sit and practice daily students i know it is very difficult because you all are tied up with so many other activities you have the your academics and the priority of course the even exams are nearing when exams come it is very difficult for you to practice daily i understand but at least make it a point to one day if you are not able to practice it and practice at least do the listening on that day so that listening makes half learning right so i am sure all of you will be superb and super successful in your career in music and i wish each and every student best of luck for all your future endeavors and namaskarams thank you thank you guru shrimati mala shankar it was a very interesting lecture giving insights about how these lessons help a student for building manodharmam vivadi swarams and their positions how to build a raga alapana and some tips related to kalpana swarams We really hope that this will help students in their development and progress. With this we will be concluding our award function. Thank you for watching the award function. A big thank you to everyone. Namaste.